It has been a crazy past week and especially weekend with water in Michigan. And so if this is you, if you have had some water damage in your basement, please reach out. Whatever the damage is, it's a good idea to reach out to us. We're gonna make sure that we get the right people to you. We're gonna see if we can find coverage for that uh, water issue that you have, have in your basement. But we wanna prevent any further damage. Water can cause a lot of damage, rot and mold. And so we wanna make sure it's dried out appropriately. Now, uh, because, because this has been an issue for a long time, because the water has it's just been raining and it looks like it's gonna keep raining, it's gonna also cause some further issues that we wanna help be preventative about. And one of those is your sump pump. Your sump pump has probably been running uh, constantly if you have a sump pump in your basement. It's been running constantly, which means it's hot. Your dehumidifiers have been running constantly, uh, de uh, trying to, de for me, I know in my basement, I've been running my dehumidifiers to keep it uh, it's, it's so humid down there from the water. And so uh, we wanna make sure that we don't have any further damage that's caused by that. So I wanna encourage you to do two things. If you have a sump pump in the basement, go downstairs and make sure it's still working. Check it. Uh, you, there's a little like switch you can, you know, typically the little float valve. Check it to make sure you can hear it still working. Make sure it's still kicking out water. This will prevent further damage from happening if, as it keep, continues to rain this week. Uh, if it's failed now, let's get it fixed. It's really easy to get those things fixed. Really, it's 150, 200 bucks maybe. Uh, I've done it myself a couple times in several house, houses I've lived in. It's, it's e as easy as really plugging it in and putting the hose on top and dropping it in the hole. And so there's great instructions on how to do that uh, on the specific sump pumps that you purchase. But if it is broken, let's get it fixed because otherwise water is going to back up into your house and cause a lot of problems here, uh, especially coming this week as it continues to rain. Your dehumidifiers, they might be running hot. They might be uh, uh, a little overworked. Make sure they're not hot. Make sure they're not fried or smelling of smoke. Uh, we want to prevent any fires from happening, any damage from happening from those uh, dehumidifiers who have been running off of the hook. So please check your sump pumps, check your dehumidifiers to prevent any further damage. Now again, if you already have water in your basement or signs of water, reach out to us. We want to get a mitigation specialist out there to stop any further damage from happening and get it put back together for you. We also want to find coverage for you as well. Now, saying that we know, and you probably know this as well, flood is not covered unless you have a flood insurance policy. Uh, so if it's just flood water coming in from the outside, there may not be coverage. However, please still reach out to us because we wanna to try to find coverage for you and we wanna make sure that your house gets put back together and that the water does not cause any further damage. I'm so sorry that if you've, if you've had to go through this this week, I'm so sorry about that. Uh, we've had a lot of clients who are dealing with this. We're here to help. This is why you pay Trumbull because this is how we come to play. We're gonna help you. We're gonna help put things back together and we're gonna guide you every step of the way. Please reach out to us, communicate with us so we can help you through this process. This is already considered a catastrophic claim, meaning there's a lot of people who have already had a claim. So there might be a little bit of a, a, a day, maybe a day lead time, but we've already seen crews going out even this weekend uh, to start assessing, uh, assessing problems and starting to get checks cut to get things put back together as quickly and as efficiently as possible. So please reach out. Reach out today if something's happened and we'll help you as best as we possibly can. Thank you for your business. This is why we're here. We're here for these moments. We look forward to serving you.